history in the making tonight. We are just hours away from a summit addressing abuse in the Catholic Church. Here are live pictures from the Vatican where tomorrow bishops from around the world will discuss the protection and prevention of sexual abuse of children and vulnerable adults. Survivors and advocates also gathering in Rome demanding transparency and changes. So this all happening hours before the bishop for the Charlotte Diocese released a video apologizing to anyone who's been a victim of a predator priest. There's a lot of moving parts with this story, and there's a major impact to Catholics across the Carolinas. NBC Charlotte's Rachel Brown is live tonight outside the Charlotte Diocese walking us through these developments. Rachel. Yeah, Sarah, Fred, this is a big deal because tonight we are hearing from the Bishop of the Charlotte Diocese, and this is only the third time he's spoken publicly about this since 2004. Please join me in praying for healing for all victims of sexual abuse and also for a productive outcome from the meeting with the Holy Father. Bishop Peter Jugis and nearly 200 other Catholic church leaders from across the world meeting this Thursday through Sunday in Rome to discuss the crisis of priests abusing children. 6,846 priests accused of sexual abuse since 1950. 19,000 people report falling victim to their abuse. Our effort to combat this. In this video posted to YouTube, Bishop Jugis urges victims to call police but he doesn't say whether Charlotte will release a list of accused priests. Just this week, Belmont Abbey named two former monks who served in Gaston County, one of them accused in 2006 of sexual abuse in the 1970s while he served at St. Michael's Parish in Gastonia. The Diocese of Charlotte investigated and deemed it a credible allegation, but never made it public in its newspaper. Independently, NBC Charlotte identified at least 14 clergy members with ties to the Charlotte area who were previously accused. The Diocese of Charlotte, in solidarity with Pope Francis, offers a sincere apology. And you're going to want to watch NBC Charlotte tomorrow night at 11. For the first time, you're going to hear from an accused priest who has asked point blank if he has abused children. His response tomorrow night at 11. For now, I'm live in South End, Rachel Brown, NBC Charlotte.